Oh, good evening, everybody. It's been about a day. The Pokimane video was released. Her apology. We'll, we'll call it what it is. It's an apology video. A YouTuber apology video. Which means it, it does nothing. It means nothing. Because it's just words. Pretty little words. Here's the thing, I've been watching other YouTubers and streamers with multiple channels, and they've all had their take on it. Some people more valid than others, because they've been in the middle of it. Other ones have just been watching from the outside, much like myself. And here's the trick, I've been seeing people go on one of two extremes. Um, yep, she apologized, that's good, I'm happy with her. Or, no, doesn't matter, no, 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 no. So here's the trick, I'm falling on the I don't really care what she says because I listened to the words she used and what she said was for every apology she never really apologized she apologized for her actions that you made her commit go watch it yeah honestly uh, you know what I'll include a link in the description below how about that you can watch it yourself it's not that long and hell even like the last three minutes of it, it's just her shilling her own channel. She's supposed to be on vacation. And now she decides in the middle of her vacation to apologize. In the most female way I've ever seen an apology. Where it's incidents that occurred that I should have behaved better. Here's the thing. The blowbacks DMCA thing? That's, that's, that's years old. And by her own admission, she already apologized for it. So, what? Are you double dodeca apologizing for it? Is it super ultra wrong now that you acknowledge it again? Again, you didn't really apologize. To, it's a Gundam. You didn't apologize to him. You're apologizing to your community about him. Unless he comes out and says, oh yeah, I got a DM, I got a DM from her and she apologized. I haven't seen or heard any of that. And here's the other kicker, people. If someone says they apologize to you, and then nothing changes, did, did they apologize? Where's the recompense? I don't see her trying to make up for going after his target, for after his sponsors. Or, oh, I cost you an endorsement deal? Here, let me get in touch with them Let's make this right. I overreacted. I understand. You acknowledged that what you did was over the line. I went over the line. Let's make it copacetic. No, it's... Okay, my community. I'm sorry of the incident with it's a Gundam. But he made insults to the Pokey fans, and you can't do that. So, again, then, are you really apologizing? It's kind of like saying... You're, you're sorry you kicked my dog, but, you know, it shouldn't be in my yard and I wouldn't have to kick it so hard. You didn't really apologize. You just made the platitude and I'm supposed to accept it or I'm the one in the wrong now. Because, again, just watch it. There is no apology. It's a YouTuber apology. It's her saying she's sorry to people she didn't hurt. Her fan base who are going to accept whatever she says is gospel truth. How about for everybody else? There are people who don't follow the drama. Heck, I barely follow the drama. And I can tell what that was. If you've dealt with people of her persuasion, of that ilk, that style of <clears throat> content creation, they have that nasty habit of being almost sociopathic in their ability to blame you for their screw-up. You know, you can almost take it. You know what? Take the L for It's a Gundam. He made fun of her fan base. Say what you will if that's simping or not for them. If that's your bread and butter, you're not gonna let somebody, you know, enough for lack of a better phrase, piss in your cornflakes. But... Even he acknowledged after the fact, oh wow, these were just joke videos. That's my bad. I overreacted. I'm the idiot on this one. I'm taking the L. But that's not how she reacted. 
she went at him with her entire community to, in her own words, correct him, to teach him that this behavior isn't right. So if you're apologizing for it now, is what you did not right? So then what is right to you, Pokey? Do you, do you see where the conundrum comes in? Because we're back to the beginning. When you apologize and there's no changed behavior, because this is the, what, same kind of drama you've been in since five years ago, you've been doing stupid things that you let get bigger because you can't control it or you can't take the L, you make it worse, Pokey. You always make it worse. That's why people don't trust you, except for people who are clout chasers. And if that's the kind of people you want to keep around you, that's how you end up in the situations you always find yourself. When you surround yourself with human refuse, you can't, you can't really complain when all you do is smell trash. So you know what, guys? I don't care that Pokey apologized. It's hollow. It's a meaningless apology. She's changed nothing. Her behavior is not going to change. She's going to quiet down for a couple of weeks, maybe a month or two, and then someone's going to push a button and she's going to go at them hard again. Probably on her sock account she uses to hide. Um, but you know what? How about that? How about if Pokey really wants to show she's apologized? She wants to change her ways. How about we get how about you show us some recompense? Make it up to people. You cost people a lot of money. How are you gonna make it up to them? Just food for thought.